Hello and welcome to SCN Corporate Connect. I'm Jane King at the NASDAQ Market Site in Times Square. And with me today, Doug Fambrell, the President and CEO of Discerna. And uh, welcome, Doug. No, oh, thank really you. Glad to see you again. Nice to be here. And since we last talked, um, you've had some really tremendous news. So a big investment. Tell me about that. Right, we did a major financing round, a $70 million financing round with a series of institutional investors that are biotech specialists, very well known in biotech investment. I'm very pleased with the quality of investors that we brought in. And the $70 million allows us to drive our business plan as we've articulated it, to drive three programs into clinical trials and through human proof of concept testing. That should be a lot of value creation, a lot of milestones that we'll hit with the $70 million. I think it sets us up for uh, really a lot of success and value growth over the next couple of years. Wow, congratulations. I mean, that's, that's amazing. So, and Bain Capital is the main investor here? Bain or? Capital was the lead investor. Okay. There was a syndicate of seven investors. Some were existing investors, some were new investors. It's all institutional. And uh, one of the principles of Bain Capital Life Sciences, Adam Koppel, has joined the Dicerna board. Okay, so let's talk a little bit about what the investment will mean. You mentioned a little bit about taking you to milestones, but this will help you create the pipeline, do what, more research. I mean, how will that money be applied? It's primarily to drive the galaxy-based compounds that we've made. That's our technology that allows us to specifically turn off individual genes that help drive disease states and thus provide patient benefit. The money should fund the development path of the galaxy compounds we've already created. Okay. So it funds three clinical programs into the clinic first and then through clinical proof of concept where we show that we can actually have the effect mm -hmm. on patients, provide the patient benefit. The first of those two programs are in the rare disease space. We've talked about primary hyperoxaluria, a rare but very serious genetic disease that we think we can provide a functional cure for and show that in a human proof of, of concept trial funded by this money. Our second program is a second rare disease. We haven't disclosed that. We're still keeping the wraps on that one, okay. so I won't talk further about it. And the third will be for a much larger population disorder, something that's not genetic, but it's mm -hmm. either going to be hypercholesterolemia or hepatitis B virus. We'll make that decision very soon as we have a, a, a clear choice point uh, in front of us. But that program also will go through human proof of concept, all three. So that's a lot of money, $70 million, and sure. it allows us to make a lot of progress. And that will allow you to hopefully take these to market. Not all the way to market, okay. but through showing that patients benefit okay. from the treatment. Okay. That sets us up for the late stage clinical okay. trials that can support FDA approval. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, and you mentioned a new board member, so, um, and he's from Bain, so that will also, he will be a part of the company and the structure going forward, decision making, taking you forward uh, to the That's next right. level. That's right, he joins our board as a regular board member. Uh, he brings a tremendous amount of experience. Uh, he was originally technically trained, uh, but spent many years in Bain's hedge fund, and then he spent a couple of years as the chief strategy officer at the biotech company Biogen, one of the largest and most successful biotech companies in the industry, before going back into the investment business with Bain Capital Life Sciences, and were one of the first investments he made. Mm. And you point. also have that similar background, both the science and the investment. I background. was originally trained as a scientist <laughs> as well and worked in venture capital for a number of years. So you know both sides. Uh, very helpful, I'm sure, yeah. as you're pursuing these deals. So, okay, so uh, fourth quarter, year end, kind of wrap up that for me and, and where so, the company is. In our fourth quarter call that we did at the end of March, what we were able to describe is that we hit the milestones that we intended to hit in 2016. And that was use the Galaxy technology that we've created to make the actual molecules that we'll bring into patients. We'll call those clinical candidates. So we're able to drive the technology to declare the clinical candidates. With those now declared, it's a question of development. Yeah. First, preclinical to get it so the FDA will allow us to test in patients, and then those initial clinical trials that show success. And this $70 million okay. is predicated on us having succeeded and declared the clinical candidates, and now we have the money to drive and show that they actually work. Okay, so um, now that you have this money, and, and I know you've explained a little bit what you're doing, but how does this kind of create shareholder value? 
How does this propel the company forward? What are your goals for the I next year? I think it gives year? us a lot of momentum to be building value, and it allows us to not have any sort of financial overhang that we're going to need to go back to the market before we have value creation. Right, delay the process, kind of interrupt things. Yeah. yeah, it really allows us to do what we're best at. Mm -hmm. exercise our core competence, which is to create the galaxy molecules and drive them forward in testament patients. So. Okay, thank you so much. And I look forward to getting updates on this. As I look forward to the, providing updates as these molecules prove themselves. And the treatments are exciting. So thank you very much, Doug, for joining us today. Uh, Doug from Discerna, and thank you as well for joining us on SCN Corporate Connect. I'm Jane King from the NASDAQ Market Site. Have a great day.